Even when it's below freezing, well below freezing, thawing food can pose a health risk. It all depends on how you thaw it and where. That's one lesson from the Lucas County Health Department in tonight's Restaurant Report Card. It may be cold outside, but when you're a health inspector and you're working inside, temperature is everything. Health inspectors took temps at every restaurant on the list this week, including Tandoor on Reynolds. It had 10 violations, four critical. Cooked veggies sitting out at room temperature, food in the cooler not covered, and a food prep sink missing a leg. A manager at Tandoor tells 13 ABC since the inspection, the violations have been corrected so far. Next up, Bobby V's on Airport in Holland. Inspectors also noted 10 violations here, including five critical. Potatoes cooling on the back porch, unlabeled chemical squirt bottles, and American cheese at room temperature. 13 ABC left a voicemail at Bobby V's. We're still waiting to hear back. Also on the list, South End Sports Bar and Grill on Glendale. It had 12 violations, three critical. Build up inside the ice machine, build up on the walls and ceiling tiles, build up inside the beverage holsters. A manager at South End Sports Bar and Grill says everything was corrected. We had just changed owners, so we were in the process of getting everything checked out. Everything since then has been corrected. Finally, American Table Family Restaurant on Wheeling in Oregon. It also had 12 violations, 10 critical. Ham, beef, and fish thawing on the counter. Soup without a date mark, and the head chef and manager were out. In response, the owners of American Table Family Restaurant tell 13 ABC that manager is now gone. We're very clean. We're very organized. We both work very hard to keep this business going. The husband and wife add, we're on top of things. Our staff has been with us for years. We are a four-star restaurant. Now for the restaurants with zero violations, including Redwell's, where we found the staff hard at work even before the doors open for the day. The owner of Redwell's Roast Beef on Sylvania says his family has been in the restaurant business 95 years, but that's no dinosaur. That's violation free. But how do you keep the place so clean? Well, we just do. <laughs> <laughs> that's the spirit. You have employees, longtime employees. They know what to do. Oh, yes. We have a lot of young <clears throat> Young girls, but they, uh, they're good. He might even say it's as easy as pie. For the Restaurant Report card, Tony Gaptis, 13 ABC Action News. And some other restaurants making the grade with zero violations. Black Kite Coffee on Collingwood, Malibu's on West Alexis, Camwa Restaurant in Waterville. Also the bottom line on Star Avenue, Mayfly Tavern on Summit, and Giorgio's on North Superior. All of these restaurants were violation-free.